Hey everyone, how's it going? So I ended up moving the large uh, totem pole carving inside. Um, the weather here has gotten cold, been getting a little bit of snow and just rain and just, it's been nasty out. Um, so I moved it in the shop, got it standing here. It's ready for paint and stain. And uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and, and start adding color. Uh, the first thing I'll be doing is adding black. I'm going to be painting the bears, all three black, and I'll be using a water-based paint. By using a water-based paint, when I add my clear coat, the, bear, the paint on the bears won't mix with the oil-based clear coat. So that means as I brush the clear on, the black paint will stay right where it is. It won't smear or anything like that. Now, with the stain I'm going to use, that's going to be an oil base, but I haven't had any issues with brushing clear coat over the stain and the stain streaking. Where I've had that problem with oil-based black paint before, I've brushed on my oil-based clear coat and the black paint has kind of, you know, run and mixed together and it just, it didn't look well. So, we'll do an oil-based stain for the tree trunk and a black water-based paint on the bears. So the first thing I'll end up doing, I'm going to do, is get my black paint here, and I dilute it with water, because it's water-based, and then I'll be using my airbrush to paint everything. Um, that's pretty much it. I'm going to uh, turn the camera to high speed, and we'll go from there. coat of black paint on the bears another guy down there there's my third one there he is so now that that's on now I can get ready to figure out what stain I want to use and prepare to apply that um, after I apply that stain that'll sit and we'll go back through and put another coat of black might do uh, two to three coats of black total and it'll be one to two coats of stain. We'll see how dark it is, you know, how dark I want to go. That's pretty much where we're at. Alright guys, so as you can see I've got <clears throat> the tree trunk, the bears are climbing, all stained. I used the airbrush to do that. Sorry I don't have better uh, better shots in here. i got a real small shop I work out of. I hope to have something bigger one day, but you got to work with what you got, you know. Um, when this piece is done though, I'll make sure to get it outside and get some good footage of it. But for now... Um, I think it's only going to get one coat of the stain. The bears are going to need another coat or two of black. And I've got some overspray 
from the clear, like here on this guy's snout. I'm gonna have to uh, kind of sand that out. And then uh, probably hand paint the noses so they're a good solid black. Gotta paint the eyes in. Um, the two coats of black. Let all that dry, and then we'll be ready for clear coat. Um, like I said, I'm sorry I can't just walk around and give you guys a better, better shots of the whole thing there, but my shop's a hot mess right now. It's a small shop. I've got other projects we're working on, and my daughter's taking up some space. She's working on a few projects of her own. Anyway, that's all I've got for today. I just want to say thank you for watching. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Hit subscribe. I've got a whole bunch of other videos on this channel. Feel free to check those out. You know, I've got some reviews, a bunch of other carvings. I've got uh, uh, making furniture and just, I think, a couple fun videos in there. You know, make sure you hit subscribe, hit like. I'll see you next time. Thanks again.